Hey guys, this is Bethany. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we're gonna play Oceans in the key of C, one to two ratio, so come along, let's go. All right, so let's jump in. This is Oceans in the key of C. Super simple. I'm gonna teach you just a really basic rhythm that's that simple uh, one to two ratio. And so if you are familiar with time signatures, uh, if you had any classical training, it's the same as a four, four time signature. So we're gonna learn three basic chords and then I'm gonna throw in an extra little chord to teach you. This is in the key of C. So you're gonna have three basic chords, C, F, and G. So to make a chord, it's just gonna be three, notes together as such and then we're going to follow up in the alphabet c d e f and play an f chord and then we're going to move up one position to a g chord okay so let's do that again so we go back down to the c chord you're going to find a c note by looking at two black notes but you're going to come to the left of your first black note that's a c chord then we're going to go d e f and then a G chord. Then your A minor is just one note up from G. So C, D, E, F, G, A. So really you'll notice that the keyboard just repeats itself. And if you need any help with all the basics, you can check out the description. Uh, and we have a video that has all of the basics covered for you to understand the black notes and the white notes and all the things. So here we go, C chord, F chord, G chord, and then we're gonna learn a little A minor chord right next to it. All right, that's simple. All right, so in our left hand, we're just gonna play uh, basic single notes, okay? So we're gonna play a C note. Remember, we looked for the C note right here. Found the two black notes, here's a C. Okay, then we're gonna look for an F, which is down here, right by the three black notes, and then a G, and then an A for your A minor, okay? So we're gonna do a little rhythm called together right or one to two ratio. So we're gonna play the both hands together, single note in our left hand and chord in our right hand. And then we're gonna play them together and then we're just gonna play the right hand by itself. Together, right. Notice that when I'm on the C chord, I'm on the C note. Okay, so let's just go find an F and you can go down or you can go up. F chord and then pick up an F note. Together, right. And then we're gonna find a G, move up one note, together, right. And then we're gonna just find our A minor, together, right, okay? All right, so you'll have all the notes in the description below, the lead sheet to this song, so check that out. Pull that up while you're watching. So the first uh, verse, the verses are the same, it's just A minor, and then you're gonna see a little thing called a split chord. Don't worry about that, just play a G in your right hand. It is where, if you really wanna go on, this is where our course would really help you kinda of develop a full um, a full ability to play different split chords and minor chords and diminished and all the things. Um, but split chords, you would just play a G chord up here, and we're just gonna play, for the case of this song, a G in the bass. Okay, and then a C, and then a G, and then an F, super simple. A minor, G, C, G, F, and then it repeats itself, okay? All right, so we're gonna go through just the first verse, and we're gonna go ahead in a one to two ratio. You call me out upon the waters. You'll notice the A minor was held for three beats, and then the G picked up the fourth beat. You'll see that occasionally, so you'll wanna kinda pick that up when you're watching. You call me out upon the waters, the great unknown, where feet may fail. Okay, so you're gonna see that together right. Together right. All right, let's, let's repeat the first verse, and I'm just gonna go through it so that you can follow along. You call me out upon the waters, the great unknown, where feet may fail. And there I find you in the mystery, in oceans deep, my faith will stand. And I will call upon your name And keep my eyes 
rise above the waves when oceans arise my soul will rest in your embrace for i am yours and you are mine your grace abounds in deepest waters your sovereign hand will be my guide your feet may fail and fear surrounds me if never failed you won't start now and i will call upon your name and keep my eyes above the waves when oceans arise my soul will rest in your embrace for i am yours and you are mine spirit lead me where my trust is without borders let me walk upon the waters wherever you would call me take me deeper than my feet could ever wander and my faith will be made stronger in the presence of my savior and i will call upon your name and keep my eyes above the waves when oceans arise my soul will rest in your embrace for i am yours and you are mine i am yours and you are mine all right super simple right uh, hopefully you kind of were able to catch on to that once you got through it. I think the biggest thing is to just play along with me, let the music roll a little bit and just start getting that rhythm together with me, that together, right, together, right. And you should be just fine. If you want to be able to play further chords with me and develop your uh, playing, we have a whole course developed. It's really fun. It's simple and it's easy. And you're going to be able to pick up music that you've always wanted to play. So check that out in the description below. Thanks for watching. All right, if you've listened to this song and you can kind of hear that background music that we threw in there, that's kind of a more advanced way to be able to play this song. And if you're wanting to kind of go on from this one to two ratio and learn more tools and tips and riffs and arrangements and variations, uh, I've developed a whole curriculum that kind of starts out with the basics and goes all to the advanced level that I can play at. And so I hope you'll join uh, that course. It's really simple, it's self-paced and it's all online. You can take it anywhere. Uh, so check that out in the description below.